Hey, what's up guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media back with another Dokkan battle video. And in today's video, I want to quickly talk about this daily capsule feature that will be coming to global at some point in the near future. And if you guys have no idea what I'm talking about, let me show you. So you just go to your menu and you'll see a new option that says daily capsule. And right now, all it says is you haven't subscribed to this product. And if you click on this little info icon, it says about daily capsule boma's new invention has entered the final stage of development please stay tuned for this incoming new feature we hope you continue to enjoy playing dragon ball z dokkan battle so really doesn't tell us much there's not much information about this new feature at all except for the fact that we know it's coming but based on my knowledge of other gacha games and how they operate i can pretty much predict how it's gonna work and in this video i just want to give you guys some uh, insight into what I'm thinking it's gonna look like once it officially does come out and of course I do want to be very clear that everything I'm saying in this video is pure speculation since we don't have any concrete or official info from Bandai but a few things that I think are for sure is number one it's going to be a paid feature like the Pilaf Strobe uh, number two it's going to be Pretty much global exclusive at least for a while in fact based on the fact that pilaf's trove has been on the global side for so long and jp still doesn't have it for all we know this could be a global exclusive forever feature and um depending on how well it does how well it's received uh it might eventually go to the jp side as well but i do think it's going to be global exclusive at least for a little while and number three i think it's going to be very very similar to the assisto bot feature that Dragon Ball Legends has had for quite a long time. I think maybe since launch, actually. Doesn't really matter. I think it's going to be very similar to the Assisto bot feature on Legends. And for anybody that has never played Legends, let's actually pop over to the game and I'll show you guys what I'm talking about. So, yes, I do have a rank 1 account, by the way, because I haven't played Legends in a very long time. I lost my old account and I got the app just to make this video. So don't judge me about the rank one, but this is what I'm talking about. We got the uh, Digger, the Chrono Crystal Mining Bot, as well as this little guy right here, Skipper, the Skip Ticket Printing Bot. And as you can see, for this one right here, it's $10.99. It's in Canadian prices, by the way. I do live in Canada, so the prices will be different depending on where you live in the world, whether it's in the US or Asia or Europe or so on and so forth. But for me, it's 1099. And Chrono Crystals are the exact same thing as Dragon Stones for Dokkan. It's just their currency for summoning. And as you can see, for this package, you can get 40 Chrono Crystals for 30 days. So a total of 1200 Chrono Crystals when you buy this pack. And essentially, it's like buying a crystal pack, but over a longer period of time and you might be thinking yo why would i want that why can't i just buy why wouldn't i just buy the crystal pack and get it over with right well the thing is when you buy these packs you get a lot more crystals for your money it's a much better value it's just you got to play the waiting game right so for example if you were to buy a regular 1100 stone pack so this is on sale but let's say you already bought the sale the price for this one is 34.99 whereas for 1200 crystals over the course of a month you actually get 12 wait did i say that you actually okay so you get 1200 crystals for 10.99 over the course of a month so about a third of the price actually less than a third of the price and for more crystals so obviously it's a much better deal but you just have to be more patient about it right and for the skip tickets obviously we don't have that for dokkan but uh it's a much cheaper price for a lot of tickets as far as i'm aware and it basically makes the whole farming process a lot faster and less painful and i sincerely hope that this is actually a feature that will eventually be on dokkan as well as far as the ability to skip some events with tickets but you know what that's a whole different topic for a different video I'm getting sidetracked. Let's get back to the main topic at hand, which is the daily capsule feature, right? And like I said, guys, once this feature is eventually released on global, which could be a couple days, could be a couple weeks, but either way, once it eventually drops, I definitely believe that it's going to work very similar to the Assistobot feature on Legends, where we can subscribe to different packs that give us various in-game items like Dragon Stones, Elder Kai's, potential orbs, awakening medals, training items, maybe even summoning tickets for a special daily capsule banner possibly. I don't really know. I'm just throwing ideas out there. But imagine a dragonstone pack that gives you 
2 stones a day over 30 days for a total of 60 stones and it'll cost somewhere between 10 to 12 Canadian dollars, maybe 7 to 9 US dollars. Obviously it's different depending on what currency you're working with, but something like that, 60 stones, would normally cost somewhere between 20 to 30 dollars full price in the store, right? So obviously it's great value and as far as pay to play players are concerned, I don't really see a reason to not pick it up if you're gonna buy stones anyways. If you're free to play, then this doesn't really apply to you anyways. But uh, yeah, I think as far as the dragon stones go, which I believe are guaranteed if it's gonna work like this, um, I'm probably gonna pick it up myself as a pay to pay player. And for all the other stuff, like maybe Elder Kai's, maybe Ord, maybe other items, if the deal is good enough, I'll probably go for it as well. And uh, yeah, that's basically the video, guys. I mean, this is all speculation, as I said earlier in this video, we don't have any concrete information about this new feature, so everything that I said right now could be completely wrong, but this is just based off my knowledge of Legends as well as other gacha games that have very similar subscription features. This is generally how it works, and once more information comes out, once more concrete information comes out, I'll definitely let you guys know. But oh, one quick thing I did want to talk about is the fact that some people, when this was previously brought up, were pretty upset. They were saying, oh, you know, another cash grab by Bandai, which is kind of true. It is like Pilaf's Trove, where there's just, they're just trying to get more money from their player base, right? But, you know, that aside, if it's a good enough deal and it's actually a better deal than buying stones, like the full packs uh, all at once, then... I don't see anything wrong with it, especially because if you're a free-to-play player, it doesn't really affect your gameplay experience any way, in any way, right? It doesn't really impact it negatively in any way. So while I do see the whole greedy Bandai side and people being angry about that, it's not like it really changes the game for anybody that doesn't want to buy the pack. It's really just a bonus for people that do are okay with spending some money on the game and supporting the game. So. I'm totally cool with it, but you know what, feel free to let me know in the comments down below what your opinions on this new subscription feature or daily daily capsule feature is, um, or what your opinions are. I'm getting my words mixed up right now, <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's going to do it for today's video, guys. Hope you enjoyed it, and like I said, once more info comes out, I will let you know for sure in another video. And as always, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. That's all I got to say. Until next time, I hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.